Today we're going to be talking about, uh, you know, medium time, uh, backup goalie, Scott Darling. And here's his rookie card. Uh, Scott was drafted a 153rd overall by the Coyotes in 07, but wouldn't be signed by the Blackhawks until 2012 when he made his debut in 2014. Uh, through most of his career, he played a backup role, but he did win with the Hawks in 2015, uh, so he got himself a cup, and ironically, he was the first Chicago area native to win a cup with the Chicago Blackhawks. Scott Darling was drafted in the 2007 draft, 153rd overall in the sixth round by the Arizona, then Phoenix Coyotes. Darling played his first post-draft season with the Indiana Ice of the USHL before going to the University of Maine, where he played the next two seasons, putting up so-so numbers before he'd move on to his next league. Darling's next league, he spent two seasons in the Southern Professional Hockey League playing for the Ice Gators and the River Kings, putting up rather mediocre stats. At this point, he was never signed by the Coyotes, and he kept playing in leagues until he would eventually move on to the ECHL. In the ECHL, Darling started with the Florida Everblades, but he would go on to play one year in the Central Hockey League as well before coming back to the ECHL, playing with the Wheeling Nailers. And then he finally got an AHL job. The 12-13 season was Darling's first in the AHL, playing with the now defunct Hamilton Bulldogs. Shortly after that, he was picked up by the Milwaukee Admirals. But after that, he'd spend one year with the Cincinnati Cyclones of the ECHL before he eventually got picked up by the Rockford Ice Hogs, which is where Scott Darling's story really starts to pick up and his career really started to go upwards. That same season in 1415, Darling got called up to the Blackhawks, where he would play part of the season and eventually played in the playoffs long enough to be part of the Stanley Cup team in 2015. Following the 2015 Cup win, Darling had two winning seasons in Chicago before finding himself as a free agent in Carolina, where he unfortunately fell off pretty hard with his career stats, didn't win as many games, and would eventually find himself with the Charlotte Checkers, where his luck didn't improve and his record remained pretty poor, even at the AHL level, unfortunately. Following a disappointing stint in Carolina, Darling went to the EBEL in Austria, where he played one season with some mediocre success. Following his short stint in the EBEL, Darling played one game with the Rockford Ice Hogs before eventually retiring. His NHL record was 126 games played, a 54-42-18 record, and unfortunately he fell into a depression after he retired. Since retirement, however, Darling has found his niche in stand-up comedy, and he's been able to enjoy it, and he really loves what he does. So it's really great to see him have a happy end, even after his hockey career has concluded. Yeah, that's it for Scott Darling. Just a <clears throat> good backup guy. Had a solid career.